Today we are going to learn about place value, units and tens. Let's begin. What number is this? This is number 24. Let us see what is in the units place and what is in the tens place. First, the units and then tens. There is 2 in the tens place and 4 in the units place. Let us see how this is equal to 24. 2 in the tens place means 20 and 4 in the units place means 4. When you add the two numbers 20 and 4, you get 24. Now let us look at another number. This time we have number 38. What are the units and tens in this number? Let us see. Look, this is the units and this is the tens. There is 3 in the tens place and how much in the units place? Yes, 8 is in the units place. So we have 3 tens. We have 10 3 times. 10, 20, 30. There is 8 in the units place which is 8. When we add 30 and 8, we get 38. Now, let us take another number and understand the tens and units in that number. What number is this? Let us first see how we break it up into tens and units. We have 4 in the tens place and how much in the units place? 6. What is 4 tens? C. 2 tens was 20. 3 tens is 30. So 4 tens is 40. And we have 6 units. We will write this here and add the 2. So we get 40 and 6 which is 46. Now what number is this? Let us see. Let us break it up into units and tens. There is 5 in the tens place. And how much in the units place? 9. What does 5 tens mean? 2 tens was 20. 3 tens was 30. 4 tens was 40. So 5 tens will be 50. And 9 units. Let us add the two numbers. On adding 50 and 9, we get 59. So the number is 59. Now let us look at another number. The number is 40. Let us see the units and tens. What number will be in the tens place? That's right, 4. And this time, the units place has 0. This was really simple. What does 4 tens mean? 4 tens is 40. And we have 0 in the units place which is 0. When we add 0 to 40, how much do we get? 40. So, the number is 40. Now, what number is this? It is a little big. It has 7 2 times. Let us break it up into units and tens. There is 7 in the units place and 7 in the tens place. How much is 7 tens? 7 tens is 70 and this is 7 units which we will add to 70. We get 77. Very good! And now, what number is this? Let us see it. Let us break it up into units and tens. There are 9 tens and 9 units. You must be knowing now what 9 tens is. That's right, it is 90. And this is 9 ones which we will add. 
90 and 9 when added gives us 99. So, in this way, we have seen how we can break up numbers into tens and units. You can also try this with different numbers. Bye-bye!